Kevin Williams in the News 10 NBC Weather Center. What a week, what a day, what a pattern. Uh, last check, the high in Rochester today was 64, breaking the record by 9 degrees for the day. But it's been warmer in January, believe it or not. It was 74 in January back in 1950, but warm to be sure. And we've got those south and southwest breezes that are continuing across the area now. But big changes coming. A strong cold front is now moving across the Midwest, and that will be arriving here uh, later tonight. Look at the impact. 64 in Rochester, but up in Thunder Bay, 14. And that chunk of chill is ours on gusting winds with lake snows, would you believe, uh, in the mix. We've talked about that. So rain this evening here in your future cast. That'll tend to diminish uh, late this evening from west to east. And they'll catch a break, but by daybreak already some lake snows are shifting into Wyoming County on powerful westerly winds, and that's where the bulk of the lake snow will be tomorrow. But then as we head into late tomorrow tomorrow night, a lake effect snow band off Ontario will start cranking up, especially with a connection to Lake Huron, which could make things a bit interesting in the metro. How about those winds? Well, these are projected gusts, which by daybreak tomorrow are 40 to 50 miles per hour, and they stay strong right through the day. But note how the winds begin to shift and weaken a bit out of the west and northwest. That's when the lake snows could be a factor in the metro, something we're going to follow because we think this area, the county south of Lake Ontario, tomorrow night and Friday will be subject to accumulating lake snows. So we plunge to 34 tonight, evening rain, powerful winds late, 34 and dropping tomorrow with lake snows and flurries, focusing on Wyoming County. Seven-day lake snows in the metro tomorrow night and Friday. Look at Friday, only 23, and it stays cold over the weekend with some snow and flurries that will carry us into early next week. So evening rain, then the wind, then the drop in temperature, and then the lake flakes. Thanks for joining us. Have a good night.